Price off. That's an American thing. Never mind. Last contest. Uzbekistan and Kazakhstan. Uzbekistan come in with a 22 to 10 win over PNG. Kazakhstan come in with a 19-17 win over PNG. So two undefeated teams. This is an elimination game. Whoever wants it is going to take it and earn their spot into the main draw. So Uzbekistan come out first. Demiryan, Turgunov, Semen, Midyayev, their big man in the middle. Artur, Ovanosev, and Farkhad Yosipov. In the white and blue. Tough team. Now it's Kazakhstan's turn to be introduced. They got Gleb Zhukov. I think he's the most dangerous option they have on offense. Good size, good shooter. Always on attack mode, playing downhill. Adil Khan Marat. Sharp shooter on his team, great slasher. Good rebounder too for his size. Got another shooter here in Dulat, Yeshmuk Ambetov. Yeshmuk Ambetov. And Konstantin Neff. Neff is a versatile player too. Got good size, can move his feet defensively. Long arms, rebounder. And he will splash you in the deep end. Make no mistake about it. They are the more sizable. One through four of the teams. And size doesn't always translate to an advantage in 3x3. You want to have size and dexterity. That means the ability to move your feet quickly. You want one through four to be able to shoot, defend, rebound. Find a coin flip of day one. Let's get it. Oh, well, got to get that one up off the ground, Vanessa. That's all right. It happens to the best of us. She was like, did they catch that on camera? Vanessa Devlin and uh, Chun Wing Leong. They will do the honors of officiating this last contest. Qualifying draw action from Singapore, day one. What's good? Kyle Montgomery, AKA The Voice. Yeah, I'm still with you. Yeah, you, you heard me in Poitiers, France. I was just there a couple days ago. Women's Series winners, Germany, shout out to them. Poitier Challenger winners, Washington, D.C., shout out to them. Prior to that, we were in Antwerp, Belgium for the World Cup. Shout out to all of our, all of our medalists there. About France's women taking gold, French men taking a bronze medal, Lithuania with a silver, and Serbia with a fifth gold. China take a bronze medal for the uh, for the women. Oh, nice dunk. And silver medal is Canada. Can't forget about them. So those were all, all of our medalists at the uh, at the World Cup. It has been busy. Uh, the most busy year that we will have with 3x3. A record number of pro events with 13. And the national events are still very much intact, as you can see. Still got the America Cup on deck. We still got the Europe Cup. And these are huge competitions to the, decide supremacy in each of these regions of the world. It's all about that Asian persuasion this week. Five days of 3x3 action. Day one is nearly in the books. Okay, countdown's on. This is it for day one. Five, four. Three, three X. Three. All right. It's on now.
When the final horn sounds, we're going to know who's going to be heading to the main draw. Two from the corners, a no-go. Zukov, he will let it fly. Two to your eye, left wing. Mitiev, nope. But the big man will track it down. Cross court, Mitiev thought about it again. This time he does release it, got the gooseneck and everything. Does the track down the rebound. Oh, stepped on the stepped on the out of bounds line. Yeah, Adilkan uh, Marat can't believe it. Uh, I believe official Vanessa. She's got her got eagle eyes over there. Oh, that what what a drive right there! How did he get that one to go? Mikhaev. He's going to get his team on the board at least. Neff. He's hacked. He's going to step up and get a chance to shoot one. No problem at the line. Neff strokes it. Kyrgyzstan with an early advantage. Long ball. Off the miss. Kazakhstan on the attack, but an offensive foul is called. Blue ball. So, uh, yeah, fresh 12. Two, uh-uh, nearly wedged. Ah, turn right back over, a little sloppy. Both teams, Neff will kick it out. Gets it back, nice ball movement to the corner. That was missile over the rim. Good drive. You suppose he's going to earn a trip up to the line. Shoot one. Buck and a half in. The trade at the line. So here's Marat setting up shop, top of the key. Had Neff on the right wing, he decides to swing it left. Amounts to nothing. Yusupov hands it off. They got the three-man weave going as Turgidy hands it off. Step back, Ovanashev. Step forward. Ovanashev now. He's gonna let another one go. And that caught the wind from the bay. Score stays, what's that? Marat. He's going to get a screen. They want to set him up for a good look. He misses, and the follow attempt is good, though. Nice follow there. Yeshmuk Hanbetov. Mityaev, the big man sinks it in the deep end. And then the steal. Great read defensively. Yusuf Pole, high arc on the two release. He's going to check out and think about what he just did. One point ball game. Kazakhstan slightly in front. They're about 30 seconds from getting their first break into action here. Marat finds Zukov underneath for the easy lay. 
Oh, Turkindy was waiting for the up top. Neff will drop it off, and Zuko puts another cookie in the cup. Kazakhstan with a three-point advantage here. Approaching that seven-minute mark. Ivanoshev, he lets it fly just a little long, high, high on the rebound. He does not get the scoop. He does get the turnaround off the glass to fall. The drive on the baseline, not a problem. Kazakhstan leading by three. The big man trying to answer. It goes off the iron. Zuko lets it go. Didn't have the right rotation. Jev to the corner. Man, they are letting the deuces fly. They are wild. The floater didn't have enough float. That ball tied up. It'll be awarded to the defense. It's as good as a turnover. And a TV timeout. 6.23 left in a three-point game. Kazakhstan slightly in front in a play-in game to the main draw. All right, both teams re-enter the quarter play. Kazakhstan ball. Looking to add to this three-point advantage they've built through three and a half minutes of play. Neff swinging through. He knew he could get the step, but can he finish it at the rim? He already answered the question before the sentence was over. That's how fast he is. 8-4. Yusupo, he's taking his time. He flicks the wrist, but the stroke was broke. That ball's going to go to Kazakhstan. Marat will swing it. Two ball corner, no. Neff will track down the rebound. Marat, oh, just hardly missed that one. I hate those as a shooter, trust me. Eight four, took his time letting that one go. FaceTime. This ain't no video chat, neither. Push that one in, in the defender's face. It's Kazakhstan lead it, eight to six. And an offensive foul. Fourth on Kazakhstan. Two point game, five thirty one left. Bono said we'll start the possession. You suppose jab step, testing the defense. The dude is NASCAR fast. Eight, seven. Big two ball. Kazakh staying out by three. Told you Marat was a sharp shooter. The guy looks like a sniper. Turgeny, can he answer back? He wants a screen, he picks up his dribble. So just a tick over that five minute mark, Kazakhstan. Maybe keeping a three point difference for the better part of this game. Neff trying to set something up. He wants Murat to set up on the right wing. Let's see what he's got uh, up his sleeve here. A uh, hole. That number two on Uzbekistan. But I taking his time to set the uh, offense up. That's a foul on the floor. White. Next 
Get the physical out there. That fire no good. Ten, seven. Four, under 440 to go. This is it, y'all. Final game of the day. Bono Shev, he wants it back on the left wing. He hit one from there just a while ago. He's shooting again. He's going to have to reload. That one to misfires. Zuko swings through. He's going to attack the rim. And a foul call. The issue is he leaned forward instead of going straight up. That's going that's to get you a whistle that you don't want. And Zuko makes easy work at the stripe. It's a four-point lead for Kazakhstan. White bow. High arc on the two release. No. So new possession as that one goes out of bounds. Big man showing some uh, nimble feet on the baseline. Didn't quite have the touch on the release though. Steam step aside for just a moment. 3.58, our second TV timeout. Qualifying draw, I. This will be it. Pretty good action to this point in this final game. It is a playing game, a lot of emotion. Neff, here he is. He's got 10 seconds to work with. Neff. Oh, and Neff. Try to get fancy with it. Oh, tough score. Makes it a three point game. Uzbekistan is not dead yet. I'm telling you. Up is no go. 332 go. Oh, back iron high bounce on the rebound. Neff. No, he can shoot that. Fires the blank that time. Yusupov doing his dance. Left to right rock pull up. Nope, too much sauce on it. Neff, has he? Neff says, enough. He gets to the rim in a rush. Oh, right back. Turganov, two-piece, no biscuit. It's a two-point game. Now Marat, the sharpshooter, he decides to pass up the two attempt. Try to contort his body on that layup attempt. Cannot make it happen. Now he might be in trouble. Ooh, nearly got a steal there. He needs a breather. Two thirty five left. Two thirty five left. Vanessa wants to go over to the scores table and sort something out. It would be the shot clock. Oh, legal screen. 
Targety got whistle. Six foul on Uzbekistan. That means they got no more to give. 2.30 to play. Marat, ISO game, left wing, little hezzy. Lefty, finished with the scoop. Said, I wasn't gonna wait for you to get ready. No more, oh my goodness. The answer from two range, you suppose. He said, you supposed to defend me too. Yeah, you got me on the drive. I'll take a two for one discount, 13 to 12. Oh, pull up mid-range. Gets the friendly bounce. Yusupo doing his dance. Kicks it. Ovano Sev, he's got the step. Ovano Sev, stay up now. Oh, look at the defense, though. Yusupo with the thievery. Yusupo lets it go. That one's going towards the bay. Buck 44 left, Kazakhstan with a two point lead. Take a look at the uh, last couple of buckets in this one. Well, teams opting for the mid range options instead of the two ball. Guy Clint Owen and Blake, they on the edge of their seats watching this one. They're like, let's go, Kazakh's there. Got a two point advantage. Here's Neff. Got to the rim, some contact on the way. That's number seven on Uzbekistan. Two free throws will follow for Neff. This is a play in game. I'll remind you one more time. Oh, free throw. Yeah, the first of two. Jump, jumping in there like that ball was in play. Shout out to Melina Mendez, watching all the way from Mongolia. 15 to 12. Yusuf Pov, he's got another gear. He pressed the nitrous button on him and he's gonna get his team within two. Yusuf Pov. This dude is has cat-like reflexes. That quickness is ridiculous. Mitiaev, uh, he's hurt a little bit. Oh, he peeled his banana. And now Marat. Nope. Offensive foul. Eighth on Uzbekistan. No free throws because it was an offensive violation. But a one point game, 55 seconds to go. Neff, oh, lost the handle on it. It's poked out. to the rim, a rat, oh, snatched him, couldn't splash him, no, stays a two-point contest, it's Kazakhstan, using some clock here, they got seven to shoot, Neff with the headsy move, he's got two to shoot now, he's got to put it up, he does, high arc, front iron, drive, kick, big rebound, and a Nearly got it again. That would have been a huge second rebound with Kazakhstan. 
winning here by two points, 17 ticks to go. But possession will go to Uzbekistan. They could tie this game or I think they should go for a two here. 12 second shot clocks. They don't want to risk not getting it back with enough time. So Yusupov, he'll kick it out. There's the two released, missed, recovered. Followed his shot. Yusupov got a good look. Yusupov. Rebound to Uzbekistan for the tie in the corner all day long. He's more clutched in eighth gear. We are going to overtime in the last game of the day. Oh my goodness. He's got the right rotation like DJ Lass. That is cash from the corner. All right, take your pick. First to score two in OT. What a finish to the to regulation. And now this one will be decided here in OT. That two released by Neff. He gets nothing on the shot. Now Arthur Ovanasov, the player who just hit that huge two-piece in the corner to send this to OT. He's going to shoot it for the logo, and now he's going to go straight to day three. What a shot. Frigid ice water going through his veins. That is how you cap day one from here in Singapore. I told you he was more clutch than eighth gear. He took it to a new gear. And now he's taking his team to the main draw. How about Ovanasev of Team Uzbekistan? Hand up, so what? How does the leather taste? Just as bad as defeat. The kill shot that will put it away, Uzbekistan. Stand up. We'll see him again day three. Wow. <laughs> we don't plan it like this. We don't plan it like this, but it's, it's, it's crazy how the final story plays out from what was a, was a wild day, right? All right, let's look at the highlights one last time because, uh, again, you knew it was going to be tight. You got two teams fighting for their Asia Cup lives. Uh, of course, to move on and play day three. Um, and it was hotly contested, both teams making smart plays, making strong plays at the rim. Everybody elevating their game. Uh, without a question, Artur Ovanasev was a standout in this contest, as was Neff. Neff gets to the rim, makes the tough layup. Ovanasev, a hired gun. He had that thing off safety and he was pulling the trigger at will. Trading two pieces, but a, a four point advantage at this point. And it looked like the game might be changing. Maybe a shift in the tide. Marat using the quick step, the little hezzy, left the defender behind, slow on the closeout. He was made to pay for it right there. 12 13 game with just over two minutes to play. And Neff, he activates the mid range game. That falls. But I credit Uzbekistan for continuing to attack the rim. With under 50 seconds to go, speaking of attack the rim, Kazakhstan doing the same thing. This the shot that was sent to OT. And the same man, he was still shooting the kill. Ovana 